Let's do this. Let's go check out the Winnebago view. All right, so this one's got a really, really great floor plan, and we're gonna start over here with this. This is a U-shaped dinette, so you can sit several people here, plus this makes into a bed. But what I think is really cool about this is that at night, if you wanna watch some TV, you just turn it like this, these pop up at the end and you basically have a recliner. So that's a unique feature that we haven't seen in, I don't think any RVs. Yeah, I love this that. little flip up is really, really that cool. That dinette is awesome. Very cool dinette. All right, so across, like I said, you've got your TV and your sound bar right across for your ultimate viewing pleasure. And then in the kitchen, we've got these great sleek white countertops, a little bit of a curve to the, count, to the cabinets, which is really cool huge double-sided sink. Down here we've got our convection microwave. So it's a microwave and a convection oven. And then up here we've got an induction cooktop and a gas burner. So you've got the best of both worlds right here. The cabinets in these are neat because they have this little locking button. So when the button is in, it's locked. The cabinet won't come open. You pop it out and you can open the cabinet. So that keeps you're going down the road if these are locked you know they're not going to come open so that's really cool all right for the fridge we've got a nice sized freezer and fridge combo over here huge pantry i love pull out shelves on a pantry it's just so functional all right well where's the main bed you ask it's right here behind the sofa. So during the day, you have a sofa, and at night, you have a Murphy bed. Check out the sofa. So let's see if we can convert this. So during the day, I got a sofa, I can watch TV, put my shoes on, just chill right here, get ready for bed. You take these pads, move them like this, open your feet up, and over here in the bathroom is the controller. Voila. And, and you have a bed. So it's a nice queen size bed. That's a it, big bed. Yeah, it's got a nice headboard back there, more cabinets above the bed when it's down. So it's a really functional space. So your bed's not in the way during the day. You've got somewhere to sit, but at night the bed pops down, instant like that, and then to put it up. Pull the legs in. Put the pads on. Pretty simple. Yeah. I like this unit. Yeah, simple and it's functional. Nice and so because of this layout, you get a rear bath. And I really, really like the rear bath. Yeah. You get more room on a rear bath. You do. So back. back here, you have kind of a hidden closet. It looks like it's part of the wall, but you push the button. It really does. And you have a massive closet. Yeah. So see, it goes all the way around there. Uh -huh. this a class B plus which technically there is no B plus they're all class C's but this one really does have a bunk up here so most of the class B's eliminate the bunk and just give you storage or a skylight or something like that but the view from the outside doesn't have that big bulky bunk space but there actually is a bed up here but you could fit two adults two kids two adults two kids up here like I said, pushing it, but you can do it. This has the Mercedes-Benz Sprinter chassis.
personal favorite is the Gemini or Compass 23TW. This is the rig we have. This is the rig we love. And it feels good when you come in. It feels good. So yeah, you've got over here, over here you've got the dinette that will seat four and sleep two. Love the cabinets in this one. They're very heavy. They, you know, shut tight. The bed right here is a flip up bed. So it flips up right here. Man, you look like you know what you're doing in this one. I think I do. And latches, that way when you're going down the road, the bed is up or you have the seating area to get ready. Big, big closet right here with the pull out arms. You have a 28 inch TV in the bedroom area plus a 32 inch TV in the living area. Okay, so you've got your 32 inch TV above the door. Easy to watch from the dinette over here. Good solid cabinets. Plenty of storage in the small unit. Big sink. Big sink. Double burner stove top. Convection microwave oven. Refrigerator with freezer up here. Again, just look how big these drawers are. Plenty of storage. And then check out the bathroom. For the size of the unit this is, this bathroom is awesome, you guys. It's got a skylight, plenty of space to stand in and turn around. Nice placement for the toilet. And you have a nice sink area with mirror. And we have one of these ourselves and it has been wonderful. It has. And in the front cab space, the seats turn around. So whenever you're wanting, whenever you're parked, you just turn the seats around in your living area. Lots of storage up here and a nice skylight. Nice skylight. Lots of storage up here, all the way around. And lots of cubby areas up here. behind the dash. And we absolutely love this unit and highly recommend it. For the price, you can't beat it. Yep. So we found something different. This is a B plus, but it's a much longer B plus than what we've seen before. This brand is a Phoenix Cruiser, and it's got a shape like this to it. Almost it's like a van. It's like yeah. a van shape. Yeah, the ceilings are very uh, not tall. Right. But we've looked at a couple of different floor plans, and we do like this one the best because of the coloring. So in here, you've got good colors, light walls, gray interior furniture. They have great little layouts. They do. Them. Very functional. Yeah, so you've got the seating here, and then you've got a kind of like a recliner rocker chair there. And then above the cab is your TV. And you can tell it's a JBL sound system. It's got a Sony uh, DVD player in here. kitchen area we've got your um, convection microwave oven big st big sink that's got the covers and you can tell this is the heavy-duty Corian countertop and you do have a countertop extension over here two burner stove top good heavy oh I just love okay little details I love that it has the dividers because yeah, that's, it's important it is finding dividers that fit in these drawers is not always easy and those are good solid drawer uh, cabinetry you've got your refrigerator with the separate top and bottom and check out this pantry that's unique and again good quality craftsmanship in these very smart pantry coming back here this is the twin bed model so we've seen a couple of different models but this is a really functional model 
no, you can't snuggle, <laughs> but this does make into two, into one big bed, but you've got your two beds on either side. Space-wise, it makes a lot of sense. Storage above and, and below. And then you have the all-popular rear bath. So the, in the rear bath, you have a big closet and then your commode, your sink, and your shower. but there is this table that comes on here so you do have a space to eat. I really like the finishings they've used here. That's kind of unique. And they have lighting on the inside as well. Big rectangular sink. I like that. Over here, we've got a we've got an actual oven. So up top is your microwave. We have a three burner cooktop and a true oven. You do have a little step up in here. Some coaches Watch have your a, step. Yeah, some coaches have a step up and some don't, but this one does. And then this is one of those cool refrigerators that opens from either side. That's always neat. I just think it's neat. You probably would never use that, but it's cool anyway. You never know. And then we have the corner bathroom here. The vessel sink. Nice size shower with a regular sliding door and uh, ample space for the toilet. Very nice. Folding bed. So it, oh, it's a nice mattress. But in here, yes, you do have the flip up bed. So since the bed is on a slide, whenever your parked bed comes down, whenever you're ready to move, you just flip the bed up and slide. then the slide comes in. But you do have big closets here in the back. This closet actually runs from here all the way to the end of the wall. So a lot of space, very functional. And we're calling this a class B because it looks like a B from the front, but there is technically a bunk up there above the cab, so really a class B. So this is the Tiffin Wayfarer. There are several different floor plans, but this is our favorite. So let's go look at this one. Okay, so inside this one, you've got your living space here with kitchen on one side and sofa on the other. Your TV with sound bar is above your kitchen area with the sofa on the other side. Two burner stove, deep sink, Heavy Corian countertops in here. Nice faucet. Windows here. You do have a piece you can pull out here for extra workspace. Nice big heavy duty drawers. And cabinets below. area you've got your convection 
induction microwave oven. Nice size refrigerator because it's got its own freezer area and fridge. And as you come through here, it's a split bath. You've got your shower on one side and toilet and sink in the other. And then you just open this door like so to use both of them. bedroom area you have a queen bed it is a flip up queen bed so this is going to come up as this is on a slide and the slide will come in whenever you're driving but pull, pushing on the mattress this is a very very comfortable mattress my only issue would be that seam in the middle I'm not sure how comfortable that part would be nice size closet for two people over here with a drawer below and your control panel is up top and then a TV opposite. We've got a, a double piece freezer and refrigerator. Very big. More storage, more storage, more storage. And this is a twin bed unit. So it will make into a king right here. I'm kind of where I like the twin bed units. I mean, I you like can't snuggle. snuggle. We like to snuggle, but still you get a good night's sleep. Yeah, but they're functional because you can walk through here. This has no slides, by the way. This is a very functional unit with no slides out. Hey, but that's one less thing that can malfunction. Yep. And then it's got the rear bath, which I like. So you've got your shower here, your toilet here, and the sink. This is a very functional little coach. and make one bed. You got a seat belt here, so this one will sleep three. You got one, one person can sleep here. That's your little kitchen. The sink folds up. That's pretty nifty. Two burner stove. Storage, storage, storage everywhere around. And then over here, you've got your convection microwave and your I don't know why I like opening the refrigerators. It's a refrigerator. <laughs> Tight squeeze through here. And here's your closet. So you've got a double sided closet with drawers at the bottom. Bathroom right here. We'll show that in a sec. And then come back. This has a rear bed. 
Yep, rear bed here. So tight fit in here, but if you're wanting a unit with no slide, this will do it. This Simple, will do the job. gets the job done. I will say for no slide, it's got a lot of room though. Yeah. All right, so you've got a TV back here and a TV in the front area.